so we are just pulling up to Long Beach, Washington. We've been driving all day, well, for the past three and a half hours from Tacoma. It feels like all day because it gets dark so early. I know, honestly, like it's almost sundown and it's like three o'clock um, as it goes, but it's actually been such a beautiful sunny day, which is, you know, when, it, when sunny days happen when you're in the Pacific Northwest, you just have to take it as a blessing. Um, it's been so, so sunny on the drive and just absolutely gorgeous. Um, all that said, we are starving because we haven't eaten since breakfast. So the very first stop that we're gonna make today is getting food and then hopefully doing a little bit of exploring today. We have some plans for tomorrow and I mean, well, we have plans for the next five months. So um, yeah, let's get the first order of business done, which is eating. be very specific when you're looking things up here because you have to put Long Beach, Washington, Washington, I can't speak. Washington. You have to put Long Beach, Washington. It's a very special thing too. This is gorgeous. Wow! Get the camera off me. Look at this. Oh my god. Okay. So this is absolutely crazy. I've, uh, we had no idea that you can just like drive out onto the beach like this. So like, I'll see if I can get that. Okay, I'll try and get the ambulance and the ocean. But like, what the dude, this is so cool. We had no idea that, uh, that you could do this. We were like, oh, we'll just like hit the parking lot and then like walk down the boardwalk to see the water. Um, and then there's like all these cars just like driving on the beach. So I didn't want to go too far because I was like, it felt kind of like mushy. So I didn't want the van to like mush down into the sand, but um, it looks totally fine to me. So um, yeah, I think we'll stay in this spot though. I don't want to, I don't want to push my luck just in case. Wi-Fi in the van, like it may, it really kind of does make. Real time, but he yeah. sure heard about it after the game. It really kind of does make it feel like a home, like. Yeah, we got our Wi-Fi set up. and yeah. got your noodles made. Wi-Fi noodles. Have a beer in a minute. Morning. It's a uh, holy sh look rough. The uh, reflectix over the windows. I don't know if it worked that well. It's 10 degrees in here. It was 9 degrees when I woke up. Um, I'm still. I could feel the cold a little bit through. Uh, this wool sweater and sweatpants and long johns and all of that. So it is a little cold, but that's why we're going down south. <laughs> Thank, you Thank you so too. much. It was raining all morning, like while we were sleeping, and 
if you know us, you would know that we actually love that. Like we love the sound of the rain on our van. Um, and then we were leaving Washington State and right as soon as we were crossing the bridge uh, over to Oregon, it's just not raining on the Oregon side at all. Just the rain just like dead stopped. It was like, welcome to Oregon, and it just stopped raining. <laughs> it was so nice. I was just saying to Nick that like, my favorite part about driving through here so far has just been like all the quaint little towns and something that I really love that we definitely don't have where where we come from. The cute little like drive through coffee shack things. They're everywhere and it's so cute. Although I must say our coffee this morning was very expensive. It's quite strong as well. It's very strong. I'm I like, think I got, I got, uh, because I just wanted like small coffee because I haven't been drinking all of the coffee. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I'll get a small one, but I, I think it's still just an, like an espresso shot or two or something. It's just less water. It is. Okay, so I didn't know that. So I just chugged back this coffee and now I'm like, Oof, like. They still put a shot of espresso, like they're not gonna put half a shot of espresso. No, I small. know, I just didn't like, my brain thought of like drip coffee. Oh I wasn't, yeah. Yeah, like I didn't really think about it. I was just like, oh, yeah. less coffee, less caffeine. Yeah, no, even if you just got a shot of espresso, it'd be the same thing. You just wouldn't have all the water and milk and stuff yeah. in it. Oops. Um, anyways, it is really beautiful right now. It's not raining, like I said. Um, it looks like it might later, but we're getting a little bit of clear sky, so. We're about 10 minutes from Cannon Beach, and it is 8.20 a.m. Um, having pretty good luck so far. It's a beautiful day. Um, and excited to see more today, I guess. This is fucking incredible. This is so cool. came in it is pouring rain the wind was like really intense and the tides were coming in so we just ran up the stairs putting our cameras away because they were just fully out like you can even see this right now um and now we're walking back to the van but holy <laughs> it's just i mean it, it's exhilarating nature is absolutely amazing it is so beautiful here big mess. We don't have a lot in terms of groceries so we just got a couple things that we're gonna munch on here. There's no like major grocery stores here. It's just like a cute, there's one cute little market. I think there was another one too. Um, that's okay. We can wait till we get to a city today um, which will be there soon but it's just kind of snacky right now so put some cream cheese of our beaten cream cheese on there. Our cheese, which we got in Canada. We love that brand. Um, got olives, tapenade. Kind of stranger. There's something freaky about that eater. That's standard strange addiction freak show where it's like, I like to chew on rocks all day. Cause I so unfortunately we wanted to stay uh, in Cannon Beach for a little while and maybe get some more footage and just kind of walk around a bit but I mean the weather right now isn't too bad but it was so windy and so rainy we couldn't even pull the cameras out to like film I think Rachel kind of got a shot when we were at that bus stop but um, I think we're gonna just head in towards Portland we've got some cool shots there we kind of saw what it was all about but I think we're gonna go towards Portland maybe stay there tonight um, and just check some stuff out this is like our next big stop, so I don't know how long we'll stay there. We'll see. Definitely need to do some skateboarding and definitely need to get some bomb ass vegan food. No, that's garbage. <laughs> that's a little bit of snow though. Snow. There you go. I mean, I'm the worst Canadian ever, apparently, because I just mistook garbage for snow. But I mean, it did look like a big ball of snow. It 
did look like snow, right? Yeah. But it's still funny. It's the same snow and it's just a big bag of garbage. Especially. <laughs> especially in the context of a Canadian in America. Just stopping here at a Safeway, we need to grab some groceries. Um, and we also need to grab a broom and dustpan because uh, when we were driving over the Sunset Highway between Cannon Beach and Portland, our like back doors, like above our bed, like where the the cabinet is that I built, um, just like opened, and one of the baskets fell out, and it had our light, like so when we do like sit down vlog style kind of videos, we have like a big light that we use, um, and the one bulb just came out and smashed, which is fine. We figured once it broke we would probably just invest in like a ring light or something anyways but um yeah just a fun mess to clean up and uh hopefully we can get all the glass because we don't need anybody hurting their feet I don't even know how that fell because now this is closed again. But it, like where that plastic bag is, that's where it normally, I'm just, I'm very confused. Well, they say keep Portland weird and us brushing our carpet in the middle of the city is probably as weird as it gets. So, you know, don't worry, Portland, we're doing it. Not getting normal anytime soon. <laughs> Nothing in my life is telling me that in the near future, I will be anywhere near normal. So there you go. So we had so much fun walking around and those tacos that we got, they were $2 each. And so we spent $4 and we didn't really think that it was gonna be like a lot of food and it was so heavy and actually so good. But speaking of food today, we are off to film a food vlog, which will be the next video. I think that we'll be posting on the channel here in Portland. So we're gonna close the video here. Thank you so much for watching this video and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>